Chapter 3. Flash is rescued from the energy pit and escapes with Darkoff from Ming's palace. Ronald, Baron's captain, learns there is an antidote for the Purple Death, a mineral known as polarite, found only in frozen, unlivable Phrygia. Flash and Darkoff promptly lead an expedition into Phrygia, protected against the unlivable cold by a discovery of Darkoff. A Ming ship sent to destroy them sees Flash, Dale, Baron, Roca, and one of the miners climbing a huge mountain searching for the polarite. They drop a bomb. It misses, but starts an avalanche, which... that has carried Flash and the others to destruction. No hope for any of them. No, there isn't. We must blast Ming's men from the sky. the activities of Flash Gordon and his party. I may be able to get Dr. Zarkov on this radio. Whom do you hope to talk? I must inform Princess Aura of what has happened. Doctor, look. The Ming ship is returning. Ship ready to take off at once. Yes. All the workmen in Dan's ship. Isn't that a ship taking the air? There's another one still on the ground. Looks like one of ours. They must have stolen it when they left Mongo. We'll destroy them both. Hannah, take care of that ship that just took the air. Ship is a mess. Our number two ray cannon has been disabled, sir. They're coming at us from the other side. Report what's happened. Yeah. Take the 
control. Yes, sir. Fly low over the scene of the avalanche. Right, sir. The chasm directly in the path of the avalanche. They may have fallen into it. It's not impossible. We have to land and explore it. I'll radio Baron ship to bring them in. the rescue party immediately. That's fine, Dr. Zarkov. But hurry, we can't hold out much longer. See that the men are thoroughly insulated, or we shall encounter extreme cold. Dr. Zarkov is organizing a rescue party. They'll be here soon. Do you think they'll, they'll ever reach? With Dr. Zarkov leading them? Sure they will. We shoot magnesium torches to everyone. Yes, sir. Do you think they're in that chasm we flew over, Doctor? If they're not, We'll never find them alive. an angel attack upon the world, we cannot start to mine it yet. Now why not, Zarkov? What is more important? Your health. I must first be sure that none of you will suffer from exposure. Oh, we fall in good shape and barren. That remains to be seen. I want you all to order your cabins and rest for 24 hours. I'll keep you under close observation. Yes, and in the meantime, that Ming ship you drove off will come back prepared to wipe us out. Well, we'll have to face that emergency when it arises.
supply. We have mine enough full right to begin my work of combating Ming's purple death. Let's get some to the ship. Okay, Doctor. What I've learned, we can control the annihilators from the ship with that instrument. Certainly. We couldn't live exposed to the Fijian atmosphere. Well, how do Flash Gordon and the Earth people manage it? Probably some invention of that genius Zarkov. No wonder Ming wants him alive. All right, boys, that's enough. Start loading up. Look, I can see them. They're mining at the base of that hill. Get the Americans ready at once. Yeah. Tyler, land the ship behind that hill. And they won't see us until the explosive iron men are marching against us. I hear the motor of a spaceship. I can't locate the direction. Well, perhaps it's Dr. Zarkov warming up ours. Doesn't sound like our motor. A big ship is just landing beyond that hill. Close to the polarized mine. The mean to attack us. But, Doctor, without your contra free solution, they couldn't leave the ship and survive. Not unless they have some similar protection. Get us close to them as you can and find out what they're up to. Yes, sir. The analogies are all in line and they work perfectly. I'll march them around the hill to the pit where Flash Gordon and his party are working. I never saw anything like them. They must be from another planet. But they're not human, Dale. They're mechanical. Probably operated by someone we can't see. This ray gun ought to stop them. Why, they're invincible. Come on, fellas, we'll stop them. Come back, you fools. You can't fight them. They'll fight you. Well, they haven't got a chance. Oh. Oh. They're walking bombs. Operated by a remote control. Oh, I got them trapped here. I heard men have attacked Flash and the others at the mine. I have men? You mean robots? Mechanical men? They seem to be. Come on. Flash, I need our help. Failure. I'll either forfeit if I don't. 